Before we start, remember that if you're watching on YouTube, Instagram or Facebook, please give those videos a thumbs up because it helps us a lot and subscribe so you don't miss any more videos. And you can head over to my website, gailmani.com for more content, more videos, workbooks, etc. All right, so let's start with our uh, items that I had in my beach bag. Remember that? We were talking about my huge beach bag, which could fit so many things. I had so many things in my beach bag. Remember, I had sunblock or sunscreen. I had a surfboard, a beach towel, goggles, a beach chair, a beach umbrella, uh, a float. And I had, what else did I have? I think that's about it. Tons of things, right? Okay, so let's see now if we can use all these words in a game of odd one out. Let's go. The first one is arm floats, goggles, and beach towel. Yeah. Arm floats, arm floats, goggles, goggles, and beach towel, beach towel. Which one is the odd one out? Ready? Okay. So let's see. Hmm. Arm floats. Where would you wear that? Where would you wear your arm floats? You would wear them to go swim, right? Or at least, even if you don't swim exactly, you would use them in the water. Yeah? What about the goggles? Where would you wear your goggles? also in the water right and last we have the beach towel where do you use the beach towel yes you use it at the beach but do you actually take it with you in the water and get it all wet no no you don't so the beach towel is the odd one out because the arm floats and the goggles you wear in the water, in the water to swim, for example. But the beach towel, you don't wear in the water, you wear it outside of the water. You use it, actually, you don't wear it, you use it outside of the water, on the sand, on the dry sand. Okay? So that's why the beach towel is the odd one out. All right, next we have my wonderful huge beach bag, the beach towel, and the sunscreen. Sunscreen. Did you remember that word? Sunscreen. So, beach bag beach towel and sunscreen which one is the odd one out this one is pretty easy if you listen carefully beach bag beach towel sunscreen which one is the odd one out the last one, the sunscreen, right? Because it's the only word that doesn't have beach in it, yeah? Beach bag, beach towel, sunscreen. It has sun, doesn't have beach. So, sunscreen is the odd one out. Sunscreen is the odd one out. Sunscreen 
is the odd one out. The odd one out. Sunscreen is the odd one out. Good. Next we have gloves, goggles, and scar. Scar. Gloves, goggles, and scar. Which one is the odd one out? Well, this one might be a little bit tricky. I think there are two possible answers, okay? So which one do you think? Yes! And any other options? That's right! <laughs> Very good! First option. You could say that the goggles are the odd one out because the gloves and the scarf are winter clothes right they're winter clothes that you can wear in the snow for example these type of goggles the beach goggles you don't wear in the snow snow goggles you could wear in the snow but not beach goggles right not this um, and therefore since you use them at the beach in the summer these are the odd one out, okay? So, we could say gloves and a scarf are winter clothes. Gloves and a scarf, gloves and a scarf are winter clothes, are winter clothes. Beach goggles are for the beach and the summer. Beach goggles are for the beach and the summer. Beach goggles are for the beach and the summer. So, the beach goggles are the odd one out. The beach goggles are the odd one out. Okay, now option number two. Let's listen. Gloves, goggles, scarf. Gloves, goggles, scarf. Can you hear something happening around the first sound of each word? Gloves and goggles both start like this. G. Yeah? Gloves, goggles. They start with a g sound. Scarf doesn't start with a g sound. It starts with a Sound. So, the scarf can also be the odd one out. The scarf can also be the odd one out. Next, we have beach umbrella. Yeah, remember it's different. You have the umbrella to protect you from the rain when it's raining, and you have the beach umbrella. To protect you from the sun when there's a lot of sun at the beach for example so beach umbrella goggles and surfboard surfboard which one is the odd one out this one is easy i think what do you think Well, let's see. The surfboard and the goggles you're gonna use in the water, right? 
the surfboard to surf and the goggles to protect your eyes from the water, from the salt water. Now what about the beach umbrella? Do you also go in the water <laughs> with your beach umbrella? <laughs> no, I don't think so, I don't think so. The beach umbrella, you stick it in the sand and there it stays, not in the water, okay? So, that's why the beach umbrella is the odd one out, yeah? The surfboard and the goggles are used in the water. The beach umbrella is not. So, the beach umbrella is the odd one out. All right? Well, that's about it for now. I will see you in the next video where we're gonna talk about the different activities that one can do at the beach. You can have some fun, you know, on the beach, on the sand and with the sand. And you can also play in the water. There are tons of different activities that one can do at the beach. And that's what we'll talk about next time. Bye.